How long is an extended period of time because I just mixed coolant a couple of weeks ago without knowing it was bad? And is flushing coolant and putting new in going to be good enough? Okay, so this was a question that was in regards to mixing coolant. So uh, if you're not familiar, VW and Audi have specific coolant, G12 or G13 is the most current one. Uh, I think they have G13 plus, but mixing coolant. A lot of people will end up putting green coolant, green phosphorescent coolant into G12 or G13 cars. They have pink coolant. Mixing is a problem. So yes, mixing is a problem. It is something that I said for an extended period of time, a couple of weeks, I wouldn't worry about. Usually it's for, I would say, potentially months that it would happen and even potentially longer. The correct way to resolve this would be to, what I would suggest is pull the return line off the coolant bottle, put it into a bucket, uh, continue to dump water into the system until you see the hose, the stuff coming out of the hose to be clear. Then you can feed in your mixed coolant. Once it shows to be pink, you know you have flushed the system completely and you have the cleanest coolant you can. Uh, what I have seen is, uh, I don't recall if I mentioned it when I talked about that in whatever video I did that in, but uh, what I have seen is vehicles that have extended period of time mixing, they create like a brown grit that will clog up things like the water jackets and things like the thermostat and water pump. And so the, the reason why they can do a lot of damage is because that stuff that it creates by mixing, whatever that is, and I don't really know what it is, I'm sure somebody who uh, is a chemist could probably answer, uh, what it creates can get stuck in everything, meaning the radiator, the, uh, the uh, heater core, the thermostat, the water pump, all the jackets in the engine for the cooling, where the coolant runs through the cylinder head and the engine block. So those things can get all that junk stuck in them, which can create flow restrictions, which means it, maybe your heat doesn't work anymore or your radiator doesn't work anymore, causes your engine to overheat, blah, 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 whatever. So that's why. So easy, it's very easy to do that coolant flush, although you know it will take some effort to do it, but, uh, but that's the resolution.